Welcome back for episode 4 of The Sims 2 Rosebud Challenge. This will probably be the last one that we're gonna have in a row. Because 4 episodes should be good enough for a while for the holidays. Because I'm also going to be doing another game, not just The Sims. So, currently, we need to finish working on the car which our needs are good enough that we can finish. Or we could stop and write in our diary first. Just thinking about chess. I should probably get her a chess board at some point. Hopefully we can finish this car and get started on our next project. Hopefully this motor does not have much longer. But yeah, you can see the body a lot better in the daylight than you did at night. So, our main goal for this episode, I'm pretty sure, is just to get the car and probably befriend Manuel and actually meet him in person. Okay. gonna work on it a little bit longer. Alright. Come on. Let's hurry up and get this engine going. Let's answer the phone first. Aw. Get the little doggy. Do the tinkering magazine. Um, let's work on the engine yet again. We are gonna finish this car today. Mark my words. It's gonna happen. Come on. You've got a little bit more strength than you. I know, I know. We're getting closer. Okay. Yeah, let's take care of your needs. Take a shower, get some leftovers. We'll get there eventually. Just we need to remember to take care of our needs as well. As you can see, every now and then I've got the testing sheets on just in case I need to turn things off, spawn things to fix my sim, just random things here and there. I use them mostly on my other challenges. Mostly getting her to meet some more people. Didn't even add to the money you're doing. Okay, let's talk with Manuel. Let, let's invite Manuel over. Alright, he'll come over. We'll finally get to see the person behind the uh, late night calls. No, let's get to know him. Freedom. Same joke. Same bust a move. Gossip. 
to just wait for him to stop the ballet bar. That is a wild jacket. Is that a crocodile? Yeah, that's cro oh, you got the being about a teen. How dare. Okay, so we made a friend. We'll just keep... Tell him a mechanic story, why not? There it goes. Let's see from death. Well, let's not be saved from death. <laughs> mechanic level four. Okay. So we got our friend for our promotion. Oh, it's snowing. Oh, it is winter. Okay, let's work on our engine. Whoa, cute dog. Where was the cute dog? Oh, you look like my dog. Sort of. Oh, we finished it. Adorable little puppy. Okay. Oh, not so adorable. cracked, but as soon as we finish painting it, it'll look brand new. Or she could try falling asleep. Come on, you're almost there. You got this. Okay, we'll have to finish it another time. Ay, 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 ay! That is my bed you're destroying. Man, that little dog is vicious. your deal, dude. Manuel. Manuel, you were just here. No. I'm staying here. I got things I gotta do. Okay. Let's try this again. off of that car. You could definitely pick up another one of those and work on it. And we can add on another room. Bedroom. Mm, flatten that. I 
of the log flat. And we can start moving stuff in. Okay, so she's trying to use her bed. But the graphics will behave. I'm using the bed real quick. Maybe we can move it. There we go. Now she can have the bedroom. Shall we get her? Should probably move the exercise bar inside. Since it is winter. Start with robotics. And we still have enough to get her a table. Move that phone over here out of the way. Measure. We are going to put some windows in. At least get some flooring in the bedroom. Need some wallpaper in her bedroom, but she's got plenty of things to work on now. I'm gonna take a shower, use, get leftovers, you know, the whole normal shebang at this point. Did I put the windows wrong? No. 
they just get snow on the inside. Which is weird. These leftovers don't spoil in this game. That's always a bonus. It does cost money to use a robotic station, but we'll make enough through work and selling the objects, we should be able to balance it out. And if not, we can always dig for more treasure maps and stuff. We did get treasure chests. back to a thousand. The digging for stuff is pretty good. I use it a lot when I'm doing rags to riches in The Sims 2. Though I find it better to use it on community lots than home lots because, you know, other people will fill it in, it won't bring your environment down, and it doesn't spend any time. how fast toy robots were made. That's not how you make robots. Yeah, just bang it with a screwdriver. That'll definitely work. We're just gonna ignore that phone because it's probably Manuel and we're not really talkative at the moment. money back at least somewhat. Exit out of that. Make this our last robot. probably hear the clicking. My headphone is relatively close to my mouth. taken care of. 
gonna go work on the body of the car this time. I meant to go body first last time, but... I wonder if we're gonna see a penguin go by. Because penguins can pop by during the winter. And apparently they can also pop by in the summer, from what I've seen. Which makes no sense, but hey, if a penguin wants a summer vacation, a penguin wants a summer vacation. So I would choose a much better place. So you're the guy from the Tinker's Garage. I was gonna let you be greeted, but now we can go to Will's Garage where we can just do a whole bunch of tinkering stuff. So let's actually go there. Let's take a taxi this time. We'll just go check out the place, because why not? Yeah, I know, it's almost midnight, but we can still go. Oh no, it's the little demon again. Shoe, shoe tucker. now you can see we have hobby neighborhoods where we can go to Will's Garage where you can tinker pretty much all you want. Alright, let's go. No, Tucker, don't follow me. That little demon was after me. <laughs> He's cute, but he is so evil. I swear. Hmm. Out of water. Alright, so... Probably gonna take a little bit on the loading time. But I've never actually been to Will's Garage as much as I've done the tinkering skill. Because the challenges I've been doing pretty much require me to be a homebody because I've been focused on other stuff other than tinkering. Like, I've tried Not So Berry in The Sims 2, which was going to actually be the challenge that I was going to do initially, but then I realized half my custom content for hair was not working at all, so I couldn't really go that berry with my hairstyles. Like, none of my greens were working, None of my reds. I had a few pinks that worked. But we'd be, you know, limited to like three or four hairstyles for the females. So once I download more custom content, I'll consider coming back to the Not So Berry on it. But first off, Rosebud Challenge. We're gonna get that done. My goal. Alright. Here's Will's garage. Let's see what all is here. There's a train set. TV. Model planes. can mess around on the computer for a bit. Oh, okay. Huh. Go practice on that, why not? It's here. She fears Tunker- Tunker? <laughs> she fears Tucker getting sprayed by a skunk. Even though he's a little bit of a demon dog. Oh, it's 
it's like a mixing station. Yeah, probably not her skill level. do here. Anything outside? Okay, there's a grill. Hmm. I figured there would have been more stuff to mess around with. Because it is a garage. Huh. Well, I mean, I guess you can view a whole bunch of stuff and get more tinkering enthusiasm. But that's about it. Yeah. Laugh at that stuff too. I'm feeling it. Alright, let's just... Let's just meet the people here. Tell a whole bunch of jokes. Wow, was the joke that funny? social need up. stuff we could just sit and tinker with. I was hoping there would have been more stuff that would have worked with our skills instead of just our hobbies, but it is a hobby neighborhood. So, who knows? Someone beg for me? <laughs> hmm. Well. Well, there we go. playing The Sims 2 was to kill off all your Sims and you would be the world champion. But unfortunately... I think so. You would actually exit the lot without saving and maybe try this house again or if you were trying to kill your Sims. Hmm. That, uh... That was the first. Wow. Hmm. We're gonna have to redo some stuff. Uh. Hmm. Well, let's look at it this way. Uh, we know not to mess around with the 
too much tinkering. I've definitely never had a sim die that way, so... <laughs> Luckily, it saved before we went to the garage. Hopefully. Hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm quite speechless, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I never expected that to happen so soon. So, if we're going to experiment with anything, it is safe to say that we should save before we experiment. It was you, Tucker. You gave me bad luck. Okay. So, note to self, we're not going to tinker with anything. Go ahead and paint our walls like nothing happened. Just give her a nice red wall. Well, maroon. Magenta. Burgundy. Somewhere around there. Gonna <laughs> it's hard to pretend like nothing happened. <laughs> because it clearly happened. Here and make my robots in peace. Sell that robot and uh. Yeah, I'm excited it didn't kill you either. Well, this has been an eventful episode and. I think this is where I'm going to call it good for episode 4. When episode 5 rolls around, I'm gonna play a little off camera. Not really do much, just get some money. I'll do any renovations on recording. Um, we'll, we might finish the car. Hopefully I don't die again. But um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.